School is back in session, and Wideout would like to remind drivers to do their part to help keep kids safe. Expect to see increased pedestrian, bike, and bus traffic, especially near school zones. Make sure that you're obeying the, the posted school zone speed limit and keep, uh, keep an eye out for kids running uh, that may dart out between buses and cars trying to get to their parents' car or, or into the school. Drivers must always yield the right of way to pedestrians in a marked crosswalk. Pedestrians should watch for cars, make eye contact with the drivers to ensure they're seen, and cross only at intersections. Parents need to take an active role um, in, in coaching their children when coming up to crosswalks and, and crossing streets going to and from school, making sure they're, they're walking, not running, paying attention to cars on both sides, um, just being, being aware of the surroundings. Extra attention is also required around town where kids are getting on and off school buses. When the yellow lights come on, use that as, um, as your indication that it's, it's approaching a stop and it's going to be stopping soon. When the bus is stopped, the red lights are on and the sign is out, um, it's treated just like, a, just like a red light at intersection. Close calls are not uncommon. The key to avoiding tragedy is to simply slow down and stay alert. We need to make sure that we're paying attention because a lot of times uh, kids, kids are focused on other things and don't always pay attention when, when crossing streets. Reminding you to slow down in school zones and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.